So good day everyone. Today we are going to solve problem involving hyperbola. Point P is on a hyperbola with a vertical principal axis and whose center is at the origin. The distance of P from the first focus or the F, F sub 1 is 12 units more than its distance from the second focus or the F sub 2. The distance between the two foci is 20 units. What is the equation of the hyperbola? So, solution. Okay. So, ito ang magiging equation natin. No? Why? Kasi, ang sabi dito, vertical principal axis daw. So, the principal axis here is vertical. So, y squared over a squared minus x squared over b squared equals 1. And kaya ganito ang ating equation dahil nasa center din ito or nasa origin siya. Okay? Now, remember that the difference between the absolute value of the first focus and the second focus is equal to 2a. No? Para makuha natin ng 2a, that is 12 units. Okay? So 2a is equal to 12 and divide both sides by 2, that is a is equal to 6. Now, Sabi naman dito, the distance between the two foci is 20 units. So, that is 2c is equal to 20. Divide both sides by 2, that is c is equal to 10. Now that we know the, value, the values of a and c, we are going to use the Pythagorean theorem. No? That is c squared is equal to a squared plus b squared. So, by substitution, 10 squared is equal to c squared plus b squared. Ang value ng c natin ay 10. So, dinagay ko siya dito. And ang value ng a natin ay 6. So, sinabstitute ko siya dito. So, 10 squared, that is 100. And 6 squared, that is 36 plus b squared. Kailangan natin hanapin ang value ng b squared. So, lipat siya sa kabila. So, b squared is equal to 100 minus 36. At yung 100, malilipat din sa kabila. So, b squared is equal to 64. 100 minus 36, that is 64. Now, to get the value of B, we need to get the square root of both sides. So, square root of B squared is equal to 60, is equal to square root of 64. And that is 8, no? B is, B is equal to 8. Now that we know the value of A, B, and C, pwede na natin balikan yung equation natin kanina, which is Y squared over a squared minus x squared over b squared is equal to 1. So, by substitution, that is y squared over 6 squared minus x squared over 8 squared equals 1. So, the value of, uh, uh, the value of a is 6. The value of b is 8. So, hindi pa tayo tapos. The final answer is y squared over 36 minus x squared over 64 is equal to 1. Dahil given na rin naman ang value ng A, B, and C, we can now get the vertices, the co-vertices, and the foci. So, the first, ver the first vertex is 0, 6. The second vertex is 0, negative 6. The first co-vertex is 8, 0. And the second co-vertex is negative 8, 0. And the first focus is 0, 10. And the second focus is 0, negative 10. Now, Para ma-prove natin na ang distance between the two foci is 20 units, okay, pwede natin siyang i-grab sa Desmos. Okay? So, let me just open Desmos. So, papakita ko na rin. And ipa-plot natin lahat ng coordinates. So, y squared over... Ah, wait. Sorry. So, y squared over 36... Ay, sorry. 36 minus x squared over 64, and that is equal to 1. Then, i-plot natin yung mga vertices. I vertices, 0, 6. Tapos, 0, negative 6. Ah, tama naman siya. 8, 0. And, negative 8, 0. And last, yung posi. 0, 10, 0, negative 10. Ayan. So, in. Ang sabi dito, the distance between the two foci is 20 units. So, dapat 20 units ang mabibilang natin. Okay? 
So, bilang tayo magmula dito sa baba. So, one, uh, so one, two, three, three na yan, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and twenty. So, ibig sabihin, tama itong equation natin. Hindi ko na dinrawing dito yung fundamental rectangle kasi masyadong matagal yun and also the asymptotes. And that is for this video. I hope you learned something and thank you very much for watching.